Hello and welcome back to A. Vogel's Menopause Flash. Today I'm going to talk to you about something very important to our health, water. For those of you who know me, you know that I'm always walking around with my bottle of water because I'm a firm believer that water is important for us and hydration is important for us for all kinds of symptoms, not just menopausal symptoms. For example, for sluggish digestion. So I thought it would be important just to explain a little bit why we need water on a daily basis for everyone, but especially to help us with our menopausal symptoms. As you already know, we are made up of 75% water. So it's obvious that if we don't drink enough, we become dehydrated very, very quickly. And most of us don't drink enough. Actually, we might be drinking coffee and tea, which in addition to not being water, they do have a diuretic effect. The interesting thing is that so many of the symptoms of dehydration really look very similar to our menopausal symptoms. So I'm going to try and review some of these with you and remember as many of them as possible just so that you understand really clearly what I mean. Dehydration can cause, for example, joint aches and pains. It can cause dry, itchy skin. It can give you that feeling of depression and mood swings. You can even experience memory loss and the fuzzy brain. It can even give you headaches, actually. In addition, if we look at the digestion side, it can cause constipation and bloating, fatigue, it can irritate your bladder to the point where you have cystitis-like symptoms and it can cause uh, at nighttime palpitations which are severe enough to wake you up in the middle of the night. Obviously, while we're in menopause, we may be also experiencing those hot flashes and night sweats which on top of waking you up also dehydrate you. So you can see how this really becomes a compounding effect. Dehydration becomes another source of stress in addition to all the other stresses for our nervous system, which will then trigger additional hot flashes and night sweats. So as you can tell, this particular scenario becomes a vicious circle very, very quickly. As you can also see, these symptoms of dehydration actually look very similar to our menopausal symptoms, or it even triggers other menopausal symptoms. So getting that water intake daily in our diet is more important than ever during menopause. Cheers.